Hello to everyone watching this footage. It's Leviathan here again. And to start things off, I'm going to introduce myself to newcomers. I'm born high-functioning autistic, I'm obsessed with fiction, and I'm planning to make my own creative universe like the late Stanley did. I apologize for any short notice, if any, because despite its current time, I figured I should make this video right here. This video, I'm going to introduce four things all having to do with the exact same planet. Planet Z. Which, just in case you've never played Call of Duty Black Ops 2, I haven't played it, but I've seen my brothers play it in the past, and the zombie version, zombie, zombie part of that thing, it inspired me to create these four things, just so you know. Inspiration. A good thumbs up. And if you guys bear with me, I'm going to introduce the first character for you guys. Becky Blood. Real name? Becky Starling. Height, 6 feet 1. Weight, 194 pounds. Status, hero, and expert zombie slayer. Base, Planet Z, mobile. Intelligence. Three brains to four and a half brains. Behavior. Tough and somewhat flirtatious. She'll do anything to keep her older sister from spreading her corrupt territory. Lethality. Whether armed or unarmed, she's always dangerous. Weaknesses. Being overwhelmed and occasional tantrums. Powers. She's a professional martial artist, martial arts and weapons expert, with acute senses. Her weapons include the Fatality Chainsaw, which is sharp enough to slice a double-decker bus from the front to back, and has a special timer that could teleport herself and allies anywhere she could think of. She later has her chainsaw replace her left hand after a fight with it later able to well, and able to change into a hand like appendage basically eyes light green hair brownish black and chin length origin in an alternate version of earth becky and her sisters went through a laboratory experiment that would define their destinies becky turned into a professional zombie slayer her older sister beatrix had changed into an undead genocidal tyrant and her younger sister lija had turned into a mutant hillbilly Eventually, Beatrix, now renamed to Zombie, turned all the humans into swarms of mindless micro-zombies and dominated the planet, now renamed as Planet Z. One time, Denstrini was transported by Captain Wagers to help Becky with her war against Zombie. Together, Denstrini and Becky had reawakened Lyja, who helped them win the battle, despite that Becky had her chainsaw eventually replace her left hand due to amputation. Nowadays, she would help other heroes with their own problems at one point or another. Costume. She wears the traditional redneck clothing. Team solitary or with other heroes. Origin inspiration. Zombie hunters. The next character is about Zombie. So here it is. Zombie. Real name, Beatrix Starling. Height, 5 feet 8 inches. Weight, 161 pounds. Status, villain and ruler of Planet Z. Base, Planet Z, mobile. Intelligence for brains. Behavior. Bloodthirsty and ruthless. She wants nothing more than to become the supreme ruler of the cosmos. Lethality. Extremely dangerous, let alone being already dead. Weaknesses. She'll only die if planet Z is destroyed. Powers. She has a strong healing factor, martial arts, and can summon entire swarms of undead micro-zombies. She also possesses great strength along with the impulse to eat any brain matter. Eyes. Black, with red pupils. Hair, deep black and scruffy. Origin. Beatrix and her younger siblings were once test subjects in a laboratory experiment that forever turned her into a genocidal zombie. Now renamed as the Evil Zombie, she dominated her home planet, now known only as Planet Z, but she still craved for conquest. When she later heard that Denshini arrived to help Becky Blood prevent her reign of terror, Beatrix summoned all her micro-zombies to end them, but when Lyja was released from her suspended animation, Zombie was ultimately defeated, yet wasn't destroyed. Since then, Zombie would consider Becky and Lyja as not the only ones on her hit list. Costume. She wears torn up clothes, smeared with dirt and blood. Teams, solitary, commands her micro-zombies and other villains, or inspiration, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Zombies. Here's the third character, just so you know. Lyja. 
Real name, Lijah Starling. Height, 13 feet. Weight, 2,000 pounds. Status, hero in mutant hillbilly. Base, planet Z, mobile. Intelligence, one and a half brains. Behavior, savage and overly spoiled. She'll do anything to get sugar. Lethality, extremely lethal to most opponents. Weaknesses, if she doesn't get any sugar, she would fall comatose. Powers. She has great strength, a strong healing factor, acute senses of hearing and smell, and can create severe tantrums when upset. Eyes light greenish, hair blonde with a long pigtail, a singular pigtail. Origin. Liza Starling and her siblings were once put through a laboratory experiment and was changed into having high strength and durability along with a low IQ. When she attempted to defeat Zombie in a fight, Lija was placed in a sugar-free chamber that made her comatose. Later, Denshirny smashed the chamber to bits while helping Becky Blood with her payback with Zombie, and Lija beated the brains out of Beatrix. When Becky found that she didn't pack any sugar, Lija went on a tantrum until Denshirny gave up her own chocolate bar, just to do her a favor. Nowadays, Lija would fight opponents when someone needs her help, but they always need to have sugar. Costume. She only wears hillbilly clothes that fit her size. Team Solitary or with other heroes. Original Inspiration, Leroy of Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Here's the last one I'm going to introduce. Here it is. The Micro Zombies. Real name, none. Height, 4.5 inches. Weight, 4 ounces. Status, villain and servants of Zombie. Base, Planet Z. Intelligence, one brain for each. Behavior. Mindless, bloodthirsty, and utterly deadly. They will do anything to please their horrid master. Lethality. Only when in large swarms. Weaknesses. Salt, fire, explosives, and underestimation. Powers. They have sharp teeth and nails, acute senses, and high agility. They normally travel in the hundreds of thousands. Eyes. Black and rotting. Hair. Varied. Origin. When Zombie dominated her native planet, she turned every native into small but deadly micro-zombies. When Zombie learned that Denshirny arrived to help prevent her reign, she tried to destroy her by forcing, forcing her micro-zombies to cover her entire body. Denshirny almost died if it wasn't for Becky Blood to arrive and teleport them with her timer back to her hideout. Eventually, Denshirny learned about the backstory of the planet, and with enough help from Becky, she had successfully defeated Zombie and her micro-zombies. Nowadays, Zombie would try dominating other worlds by somehow transporting her relentless hordes, emerging from the ground as they arrive. Costume? She all dress in dirty, torn-up clothes. Teams? They only work for Zombie. Or inspiration? Zombies of any variation. Well, I hope you guys are impressed with the four different layers of the exact same story, if you think about it. I hope it's worth it for you guys. And if you want, you guys could uh, like, subscribe, comment down below, and share if you want. It's your choice. Hope you guys are having a decent rest of the month. And I hope you guys have a fine Halloween and such. Amen. I uh, hope you guys enjoy the best of times. And until next time, 